Hey fellas, Edge 4006. I uh, just want to do another video. This one here is about the ammunition 30 Luger and 9mm Luger. Just going to go over the differences in the two, show you the cartridges. I'm not trying to bore anybody with Luger videos, but uh, I, just, I don't see a whole lot on this particular ammunition, especially the 30. That's why I decided to do one. Right here on the left, we have a 30 Luger from Fiocchi, or Fiocchi, Fiocchi, I call it Fiocchi. Um, this is a saw point, this particular round right here, we got here is 93 grains, jacket saw point, brass casing, muzzle velocity 1200 feet per second, muzzle energy 300 feet. The round in the middle, I don't have the specs on that, these are, this is a Winchester round, this is the one I was talking about the other day, it's pretty expensive, these suckers run about $50 a box. The only reason I even have one of these is because my dad, when he first started firing the gun, had to buy one. Uh, had to buy them online to even find ammunition. He was living in Laredo at the time. But this is a, a standard full metal jacket, a 30 Luger. And here, right here, is your Fiocchi saw point. I guess I wouldn't ever use this good for home defense, but if you ever. You had to. Well, there you go. Is the saw point. This here is 7.6, 7.65 parabellum. It's also the other name of that round. Sorry. That. These two right here. And then we have a nine millimeter. All I got some cheap stuff right now that I haven't shot. This is a tool ammo. Uh, after my SIG 2022, and of course these are 9mm, these cartridges are not reusable. I plan to reload uh, 30 Luger eventually, um, I have to work that out, but I want to go ahead and put these two side by side, and you can see pretty much like I was talking about, is the casings are pretty much the same, the only difference is you have a bottleneck going right here, I'll put this other Luger on the other side, you can take a look, again, is pretty much, they're the same case mouth, or the side, the circumference of the case, and it's just when you get to, right here, where they bottleneck, kind of like a, a, a SIG, 357 SIG, and a 40 Smith & Wesson, you know, so, pretty good example, or a comparison, and, uh, you know, the story is, you know, they wanted more firepower, so, uh, Jorg Luger, Decided to go ahead, uh, or Gay Georg Luger, how you pronounce that? Decided to go ahead and, uh, you know, widen the case out and go with the bigger projectile. And uh, he didn't lose too much pressure uh, doing it either. On the SIG, you do get, I think, higher uh, velocity on a, on a 357 SIG than you do on a 40 Smith & Wesson, if I understand. I'm not com completely 100% on that, but last time I checked on. This tool ammo, yeah, this is 115 grain, full metal jacket, 1150 feet per second. Um, this particular, it's non corrosive. Um, yeah, I mean, you're almost in the same ballpark right there. The, well, you're getting 1200 feet per second from the Luger. Um, this full metal jacket might even get a little bit better. I don't know. But uh, I wanted to go over the two brands. These are what I have left from when I was shooting last time. These are the empty cartridges. I am keeping them. I uh, wish to reload in the future. I'm trying to get a, a die set. I don't know. That's what they come. They have this little, little deal they put on the primers there to protect them. Keep them, keep them good for usage down the way. And these are your you know, tool ammo set up. Well guys, I mean, I'm not going to go into complete details like I'm some ballistics guy. Uh, I just wanted to go over, you know, basic representation of the ammunition and uh, what you got in the comparison between the two. And they're pretty evident when you look at them in the pictures here. Again, um, this is hard to find if you, do, if you do get a good deal on it. It's not hard to find, it's just not easy. You're not going to find it at the store typically. Uh, you'll find it at gun shows and you'll find it online. I like uh, to order from iAmmo. Um, Here's another place I got a good deal for. I just can't remember. It's been such a long time since I ordered. Because I usually go to the gun show and pick up a couple of boxes. Alright, fellas. I'll go ahead and 
wrap this up. Sage 4006. Man, fight the good fight and keep your groups tight. Later, brother.